600 episodes of Legos Island. Oh my god! How the absolute heck have we gotten this far? That is insane! Guys, today it is Friday, February 4th, 2022. So, as you can see, the 600th episode party for Legos Island has arrived. And this is to obviously celebrate the 600th episode of Legos Island in general, because this is episode 600, as you can clearly have told. It, you know, it says that in the title. And if you're watching this from the playlist, you can also see in the uh, playlist that this is the 600th that video in the playlist. Also proving that this is the 600th episode. Anyway, no more needing to prove that. Anyway, let's get started. And yes, I am proud to announce that a fellow dog has made their return after Operation Rescue. Yup, the dog version of myself has made a return. Only for this party. And this episode in general. After this, they'll go back to Cool Cat 33's world again. The point is, they have joined me for this party, which, in my opinion, was pretty cool. So, of course, let's jump into it. Literally. I literally did that on purpose. So, let's just start off right here by getting the 600 episode hat. Let's pick it up. And yes, I know it's only a minute away to midnight. Uh, I literally just finished this now. So, we're going to put that on right now. And as you guys can see, that is what the hat looks like for the 600th episode. So that is really cool. That was actually the first item I made. Either way, this is the port. And it looks pretty freaking awesome. With that being said, on the other hand... Oh, and, uh... I think I know where we're putting H2 Secretary. The base. I know we haven't gone to the base in forever, I know. I know. And yes, I know. You can see here, uh, I accidentally killed Holiday by accident. My bad, we'll respawn him later, alongside any other dog we got throughout the 500s. Um, and also re-including the Cool Cat 33 dog. Oh wait, I think he's still alive actually, so I think you only have to respawn two of them. Either way, this is again what this looks like. Now this is the first milestone episode to have the candles. So, that is pretty cool, because last time, when we hit 500, the candles weren't even re-releasing the game yet. Because that was May 8th of 20, 2021, uh, that we uh, hit the 500 milestone. Wow, almost exactly nine months later, we hit 600 episodes. Only by like four days. And yes, I know, it literally just hit midnight. I know, I know, I know. Okay, you see, this took a while. A real long while. And you'll see why. Uh, the items I literally just did last minute. Anyway, what are your thoughts on the port? It actually looks really, really cool. So I wasn't joking about the colors that I actually chose. These are the legit colors for the event. And it's proven. And, um, so yeah, it's back to a more traditional celebration, unlike the past few, which have all been completely different designs. For example, we have not had a milestone party like this since episode 200. And, uh, speaking of episode 200, I rewatched that just for the sake of this event happening, and also just because today we were celebrating a milestone, so why not look back at one of the older milestones? But, technically that party would be the final time prior to this event um, that we have a setup like this. At least, like this. Of course, colors being different. Because, you know. <clears throat> Those were the colors for the 200 episode. God dang it, we forgot about the torches. But who cares? There weren't even any here anyway. Anyway, with that being said, what are your thoughts on the 600 episode cake? We're going to move on to another room in just a second. I just wanted to give you guys just enough time to see this. And I really think it looks great. And my god, I really think I did a good job. I really like the candles. They're really, really awesome. Anyway, the whole island is decorated for this milestone party as always. Like, literally, the entire oh. island. Okay, maybe oh. not the entire island. But pretty much all of it. Almost all of it, at least. 
Some rooms may only just contain a free item bin and then that's it. May remind you, these items I actually did last minute. So, I kind of apologize if some of them aren't related. I literally just did these items literally last minute before filming. So, again, I apologize if some of them aren't related. But hey, I tried my best. Who knows? I could have actually done a good job. Anyway, the first item would obviously be this hat. And if we take a look around the port, as you can see, it, ha it has been decorated, as always, for this milestone party. Yeah, it's actually the first milestone party to be standalone since episode 200! Literally! This was the first milestone party in, like, nearly three years to actually be completely standalone. Because episode 300's party coincided with the Mountain Expedition 2020 and Operation Wilderness 2020. The 400th episode party coincided with Legos on Halloween. Because it landed on Halloween itself. And the 500th episode party coincided with the Medieval Party of 2021. So, yeah. Oh, also, let's hope I said Legos on Halloween 2020 is where uh, the 400th episode was coincided with. Let's hope I said that. <sighs> Probably didn't. Either way, um, yep, this is the first milestone party in three years to be completely standalone with nothing going on alongside it. Finally! Although this is going to be the only milestone this year that that's going to happen because the 700th episode's coming out on Halloween just like episode 400. But it's worth it. Yep, I literally calculated all the episodes after this and we're going to be hitting episode 700 on Halloween. So hopefully that's the last time I bring that up until we get to that point. Or at least until we get very close to it. But now, let's finally get out of the port and actually, you know, <clears throat> do this. Now, we are not going to use the dog dispenser today. And that's because I selected some dogs myself. Again, including, you know, him. But that was Kukai Freddy Free's idea, somehow. Actually, he uh, warned me at least a week in advance that... The cool get ver that the dog version of myself would be here for the episode. And honestly, that's a pretty good idea. Not gonna lie. Going in here... Oh, uh, I actually never had a good chance to show you this. Uh, here is the balcony. Kind of takes some elements from the 200 episode party and 100 episode party. I did take some elements from those parties, but not all of them. Of course, there's definitely some major differences around here. You know, such as the candles on the cakes. Those are the big major differences. Uh, the rest, however, if we go in here, it's pretty cool. And yes, I did do this, because it's epic. With that being said, um, I might as well change this one, though. Oh, uh, actually, give me a second, let me do this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I can see why. There we go. Uh, anyway. Um, here is the cave. Looks pretty epic. As always. For these parties. Oh, I never put a, a candle here. Let me go ahead and do that. I completely forgot to do that. I, I didn't even... I thought I already did, but apparently I didn't. Nice. There we go. I actually thought I already did. Apparently I didn't. There we go. That makes it look much better. Alright. So, yep. Here is the room. It actually looks very similarly to the 200 episode, just with, you know, color redesign. Now, you're probably wondering, why did I base it off of that again? I don't know. I just felt like it. And now, not because I was lazy. I was trying to think of a new design, and I just couldn't think of anything good at the time. Eh, definitely next time, though. Oh, wait, sorry. That's on Halloween! How am I supposed to come up with that? Uh, point is, though. Um. Yeah, that's how it looks. Looks, uh, pretty epic if I have to say so myself. Oh, wait. Hold on, guys. Just one second. I knew this. I knew something in the film fell down. Yep. 
You guys are going to see what I'm about to do in a second. Don't worry, it's good. You guys can clearly see what I'm doing here. That looks way better. See? Now it actually looks different. Oh, thank God. All right. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. The event room is actually decorated. My bad. Yeah. Uh, the event room is actually decorated. Yay! Finally. For the first time in like three weeks. So it does look a bit different. But it still looks... Pretty much the same as the past milestone events. So yeah, that looks pretty awesome right though. Or just right in general, like this doesn't it look pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie, this actually looks pretty sweet. Yeah, you know the deal is coming down below, tell me what you think. I've been saying that in every single event tour, even in the lab and backyard, just basically everywhere. Oh yeah, speaking of the lab. Don't be surprised, but I still haven't taken down the winter party. That's definitely a thing on the 5th. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a second. It's already the 5th, dang it! And I was gonna do the look back video. Guys, um, you know what? I'll tell you it right now since uh, this video is coming out prior to that. Um, we're gonna be... Well, didn't you know that February 4th was actually the four-year anniversary since the first ever Operation Dome event ever? It took place in Zola Zap 2 from February 4th to the 25th where Evil Seat Leader, you know, put a dome over ZL2. And it also introduced his permanent present-day base. I was gonna look back at that in the look-back video for February 4th, but I was working on this the whole day. Hey, don't worry, we'll still do it on February 5th, I promise, even though it won't be the actual day. Hey, it doesn't have to be the actual day. But, I thought I'd just tell you, that's what we were going to look back at. Anyway, with that being said, uh, no free items in here. Next free item is not actually going to be for a while. Actually, my mistake, the next free item is actually over there. Speaking of which, let's make our way over to the lodge. And this is definitely custom made. This is not reused from any events, I don't think. There we go, that actually looks better. Nope, this is actually custom. Oh, thank God it is. Oh yeah, the future banner. Let's pick it up, and that's of course from the future party. That took place a week after the 500th episode. Going inside, here is the lodge. Looks pretty awesome, I will admit. Uh, going in here, we have this. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, going up to the attic, however, there is nothing. I don't know if that's a first for these milestone events. At least the standalone ones. But surprisingly, there's nothing up there. Now, what is new for these standalone milestone events? Yep, we have decoration in here. So, hey, we got something new. Pretty awesome, right? I know, so freaking cool. Oh, hold on just one second, speaking of which. Okay, I was curious if my sound was on. And, uh, it is, thankfully. Yeah, I was generally curious for a second if my sound was actually on. Just need to make sure. Anyway, with that being said... Um... Yep, that's pretty much it for this room. Not really much to say, but it is pretty cool. And in here as well. We got this. Looks pretty awesome as well. Oh, I don't know if I ever got a good view of this room over here, though. Um, if I didn't, then I'll show you again. That's how it looks. 
There we go. Uh, I think we're oh. done here since there's nothing up there. Let's go ahead and get out of here. Now, normally I would have collected the item after exiting the lodge, but since we already did that, we can just immediately move on. Now that we actually have something new here. I don't know if there was ever actually a free item oh. in the blacksmith shop in previous milestone events, at least with the standalone ones. We have the oh. Memorial Day 2021 shield. Let's pick it up, and that is of course from the Memorial Day party. Probably one of the coolest Memorial Day parties of all time. Actually, it was indeed the coolest Memorial Day party of all time. As it linked with a time period. From Operation Legal Island 2019. So I had to include it there just to remind ourselves of how freaking awesome it was. Point is, we have some decorations here. And that's literally it. Yep, there is literally no other decoration. See? Proof. Oh, and... I still have to have the table back. But either way, I don't think we ever had an item... Oof. Oh, I don't think we ever had an item there. At least in the standalone milestone event. Or even in any of these overall. I think in the ones coinciding with other events, I think we had. Next up... We have the Jamaica flag from Legos Island Summer 2021 World Tour. I mean, come on. You do know I had to put that in there somewhere, because that was honestly, in my opinion, the best Legos Island Summer we have had so far. And, well, it also makes sense considering this water slide's here. Anyway, back to the point. The resort, as you can clearly tell, is decorated. And yes, I know, we will get the other dogs later, okay? I promise, we will get the other dogs later. I promise. Once we go to the pet cemetery, we're gonna go get all the other dogs. I promise we'll get the other dogs. Um, but I'm gonna head there first. Uh, well, once we head there. And actually, we are gonna be heading there actually probably right now, so we are actually good to go. <sighs> anyway, here's the resort though. And again, as you can see, looks pretty awesome in my opinion. I really think I did a good job at the resort this time. It really does look cool. Moving on. Alright, now let's go up to the mountain and... What? How did he get here? Lapis? You're gonna want to go out of there, buddy. Okay, let's open up the mine cart and actually take a chest. Um, we'll take a mine cart out of here for once. Okay, so we have Lapis and Lake Mushroom 27 Dog. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'll showcase that now. I don't really care if that mine cart goes. Well, you remember back in the day when I used to always stop that thing? Ah, uh, good times. Anyway, here is the uh, two small mountains. And actually, this is where we get our next item. Uh, but yep, here is again two small mountains. Looks pretty awesome, as usual. At least for these milestone parties. Moving on to up here. As you can see, we have all this stuff again. Which is pretty awesome. Oh! Yeah, you came back! Nice. Next up, we have the pink slash red fair shirt from the fair 2021 on Legos Island. Let's pick that up and put it on. Actually, I'll put it there. There we go. That's another item. Nice. There we go. Now, again, that's how the room looks. So, in my opinion, that's really cool. Alright, now we can use this. Oh, and yes, there is a free item. Yeah, the campsite, I'm trying to lay out. Or I could be wrong. Or I think at least in the standalone. The first time um, in one of those types of milestone events that campsite is decorated. 
Anyway, going up here, we have the mountain itself. Yep, it is decorated for the, uh, you know, uh, milestone. So, of course, we have the cakes right here. The candles. Which is pretty cool, in my opinion. Actually, we could have held this the entire time, but... Actually, we're literally about to replace that anyway, so, yeah. Anyway, with that being said, however, on the other hand... Um, that's how this looks. Looks pretty awesome. Let's go along here. And yet, we have more cakes here as usual. It's kind of the usual milestone set, um, episode setup. Anyway, we have the honey banner from Lego Island Halloween 2021. Uh, let's replace that. And that's the item right there. Yep, you guys probably remember that. That was pretty awesome. And, well, this is where we go get the rest of the dogs. Let's go inside, and, well, we do have them all here. We do have Jack-O-Lantern and Cool Guy 33. Oh, okay, so Jack-O-Lantern is still alive. Dang it! Halloween is the only one that we need to revive. All right, that's easy. Oh, yeah, I also have the spawn egg for, you know, the dog version of myself. Let's go ahead and get a bone and respawn Holiday. Oh, 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 whoa! Where do you think you're going? Oh, yeah. Let me get rid of that. Alright. And let's go get Holiday's name tag and, uh, color. I don't know when the next dog we're going to be getting, but maybe Valentine's Day. Who got 33 recommended I did a uh, dog for Valentine's Day? Why do I feel like, though, all of a sudden, speaking of which, why do I always feel like all of a sudden he's the only one who suggests things and not the rest of you guys? I'm really starting to wonder that. I know I should have wondered about that a long time ago. I really came to a finally came to a realization. What happened to the rest of you? I don't know. Oh boy. But hey, let's hope I can get the rest of you guys' interest in these episodes again at some point. If you haven't lost interest already. Oh my god, it's already 21 minutes into midnight already? Jeez. And still no update video. Oh yeah, I will finally film that on February 5th, I promise. Although now it's going to be completely outdated because it would have been told about stuff that would have happened pretty much now. So we might intentionally skip that update video. Because it's gonna, just going to be completely outdated now. Or is it? Yeah, I actually forgot to mention that it still revolves stuff around Zeal 3. So never mind, we can still do it. God! Anyway, back to the point, though. Uh, yep, we have everyone here now. Anyway, we have cakes right here and right here. Now, I actually did something pretty dang creative and something I really should have done a long time ago. Well, not in the milestone events, because last time we didn't have the candles, but I should have done something pretty creative. So... Um, we have the candles here on all the cakes. But can you guys clearly guess what I did? You can clearly tell what I did. I got creative. Instead of just using the normal colors of this party right here. No, I got creative and used the respective colored candles for each of the dog beds. And don't worry, those aren't the only ones. I went up here too and did the rest. Which are all awesome. You know, it's funny. We still need a dog for right here and uh, right here. Those will hopefully come later this year. This one, I think, could be a Valentine's Day dog. I don't know. I'm really thinking we should have another Valentine's Day dog. That would be pretty sweet, not gonna lie, actually. So, yeah, we have colored candles based off of all of them. Even though we don't have a magenta dog or a brown dog yet, at least brown and magenta colored dogs yet, at least I don't have one of those, because I haven't you know, came out with one yet. Again, I'm definitely thinking we're going to probably have one of those during Valentine's Day and then this sometime later in the year. 
But, um, oh, and by the way, down here, I did nothing. Let me prove to you. I forgot to decorate down here, but I actually never decorate down here in the milestone events. I probably was finally going to change that for once. Although, uh, funny thing, I normally, I did not even plan to originally. I kind of had no plans to anyway, so that was kind of completely fine. Okay, so never mind, we have Lapis with us, so we can have a ton of dogs. Wait, hold on, in total we have one, two, three, four, five dogs. Okay. Oh, dude, we could have had six to celebrate 600 episodes. Oh, wait a minute. We can change that right now. Steven's here. There we go. Six dogs for 600 episodes. Oh, dude, that's perfect. Oh. Oh, yes, I really should have done that. There we go. We got six dogs, you know, for 600 episodes. Yeah, I know. I could have gotten a little more creative there. But actually, it works in a way for some reason. Anyway, next up, we're actually not heading down to the village yet. No, of course, you know, we save that for last. It's always on. No! Come on! Okay. Alright. Let's try this again. Let's hope they're not in the way, though. Uh. Lap lapis? Yeah, move out of the way, man. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I was not even in the right position. Oh, God, they're gonna get in my way. Just me, or do they like to mess with me? Oh, come on! Oh, wait, I thought they were on the tracks. Oh, thank God. But they better not spot in front of me, otherwise, we're done. Oh! I think I just went right. Oh! Oh, dude, come on! No! <laughs> no! No! Oh, dude! Oh! Oh, I thought it was going to be sent straight back over to the mountain again. Oh! Oh! Oh, I'm very glad that that did not happen. Oh, I am so glad right now. I thought it was going to be sent all the way back. And then I would have had to start the process all over again, which, 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 which was even more time than I would have already had. You're only out here and then decorated. Well, I think only that one time during Legos Island Summer. Actually, I think for all Legos Island Summers, it's the only time that down there is decorated for something. And uh, here too. Oh yeah, uh, speaking of which, I should actually uh, spawn one of these guys. Who do we got here? Who's feeling down? You know what I'm just gonna do with all of them. Where's Jack o' Lantern? Cool, I'll deal with those guys. But anyway, campsite is actually decorated. Hey! And here is where our next item is. Oh! I forgot to put the torch back. Okay, I only just noticed that. Alright, next up we have the Camp Island 20 well this the Camp 2021 banner from Camp Island 2021. So that's pretty cool. We can actually hold that in a replacement. And I already have the banner here for that. So anyway, <clears throat> let's move on. Well, actually not yet, considering we actually have the ranch decorated. I know, that's probably not a surprise. Well, only at the outside is decorated. The inside is. And that's purposely only just because I just had no time to. And also I never thought to anyway. Oh, I just locked him in there. Who did I just lock in there? Oh, I locked Steven in there. Oh, wait, 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 wait. They're already down low on health again? Come on. How many times are we going to do this today? How many times are we going to do this today? I swear, how many times are we going to do this? I freaking swear, how many times are we going to do this? Okay, there we go. 
All right, let's go ahead and move on to the next room. And actually, that next room is the tallest mountain. Now, good news, good news, everybody. The Master Evil Linkers and Evil Cluck Robots are gone. As you can clearly see, they are clearly gone. Um, and uh, that's clearly because, um, well, they flew off. All that's left is the remainder of this statue. Oh, actually, speaking of statues, I was going to actually originally rebuild this statue, but not in the form you know it as. No, nope, I was just gonna put it back as, you know, just the normal dog statue, just, you know, with, you know, the normal look of, you know, the Minecraft dogs. Uh, um, as this statue. Another thing I was gonna do was put a statue of my dog self right next to it. However, I did not have enough time. I'm still going to do it, though. I just didn't have enough time. So in the next episode, be sure to look out for that. They'll be both located here. I'll rebuild this statue right here and then put the other one right here. Makes a little more sense, though. Anyway, we have the Cool Guy 33 banner, speaking of which. So let's pick that up and let's put that on and replace this. And the reason it's here is because this is an obvious reference to Operation Rescue from when the Cool Guy 33 dog decided to destroy the entire HQ. And seeing as everything in the HQ just got stolen a day back, this kind of makes perfect sense, in a way. So with that being said, that is pretty cool. Moving on, let's go to our next area, which is the other side of the island. Oh wait! Hold on! Before we head over to the other side of the island, I just realized, yeah, the theme park is actually decorated. My bad, guys. I completely forgot to go to the theme park. My bad, guys. I really completely forgot to do that. Um, now, this time, unlike previous milestones, only the theme park entrance is decorated. I didn't have enough time to do all the other things, as that would have took way much more time. And we also, I probably would have started filming this out. Speaking of which, as you probably can see at the bottom of the screen, it is currently 12.30. How have I been filming this for so long? So with that being said, that's pretty cool. And yep, this is how it looks. No free items here. Actually, I'm always messing around. I kind of wanted to go to this theme park last on purpose because the next item actually is here. Ta-da! The Milk Chocolate Medieval Banner. Yep. The Milk Chocolate Medieval Banner. Yep. That is from Legos Island Christmas 2021. And if I am not mistaken, that was, I believe, day 12, if I remember correctly. I think it was day 12. I think. I think it was day 12, if I remember correctly. That was almost two months ago. Yeah, correct me if I'm wrong, I think that was day 12 of Legos like, on Christmas 2021. So, anyway. Yeah, so never mind. I actually did come here on, like, you know, at this moment on purpose, actually, because I kind of forgot that there was an item here. But no, really, though, in reality, that's how the theme park looks. Looks pretty epic. And with that being said, now we can head on to the other side of the island on purpose. Because now we actually have our last item. Okay, maybe not. Because technically the last item's at the village. Oh, yeah, I can finally show you that statue I want to... Sh um, uh, I said I would, you know, make eventually. So, ta-da! Take a look. The Operation Ally statue. Although, I think I can make that a bit better, honestly, in my opinion. Um, let's put these items right here. God dang it, I, I got rid of that. Uh, it doesn't matter. I can go back to the HQ anyway. And, well, I'm sorry. I can head back to the camps. I can go get that anyway. Uh, I actually kind of change this because... I feel like it would make a little more sense if 
we did this. Yeah, you can see where things are going. You can clearly see where things are going right now. It's too obvious. Yep, it's become too obvious where things are going. That is so much better! Because now we have both my colors and Evil Cluck's colors. So now, uh, before we head over to the village, let's head over to the campsite again, just so we can uh, go get that uh, camp banner back. Actually, I can just collect it from right here. See? Told ya. All right, now we can make our way to the village for real. Oh wait, sorry guys, my mistake. We aren't actually done here. Uh, I realized we actually have a free item here. And well, this should have been obvious, considering it literally just ended. Oh boy, let's put it in here. The Festival Snow Banner One. Is as expected, considering that is <clears throat> the uh, last banner here. And actually, it's the last time. I'm, I apologize I'm a, of a majority of these are banners. Just because, well, they actually looked cool. But yep, uh, you guys probably would have expected that to be the Festival of Snow because it literally just ended. It's also one of the most recent events as of filming this video. Alright, for real this time, let's actually go to that beautiful village. Alright guys, so let's open up the chest and take out yet yeah, another mine card. Now, let's make our way over to the subway, and let's make our way to the village. Oh, and yes, uh, by the way, speaking of subways, uh, play with Alex and I, which we had. I think we did last year, but I think what? Okay, thank god there's no minecart. Oh, do not push me back, dog version of myself. No! Come on! And uh, you know what? I generally don't care right now. I really don't care right now. Okay, there's no minecarts here. I really need to reset those. Ta da! Okay, I can explain. So, as you guys know, the day this episode was meant to come out was also the start of the Beijing 2022 Winter Olympics. Oh, when I watched the opening grand ceremony, the opening ceremony of the Winter Olympics. Epic as always. Literally, epic as always. They never stop getting be being epic. Oh boy, here in the Olympics being for the first time in six months. Oh, it felt great. You know, the theme song. Ah, oh, felt great after six months. Anyway, well, here's proof I wasn't joking about that. Yep, Beijing 2022 Winter Olympics. February 4th to the 20th, because that's actually how long they go. And of course, since the Olympics are being held in China this year, I decided to design the village like China. And, well... This should have been obvious. Of course, to represent the country the Olympics are being held in, the China flag from Legos Island Summer 2021 World Tour. That's, I think, I think the second item to come out of that event. The first being the Jamaican flag. Um, so, anyway. Point is... Um, yeah, let me actually show you around all these rooms, because I actually did a pretty good job on them. So going into the coffee shop, this is how it looks. Oh, I never actually had a chance to finish this. Give me a second, guys. Just finish these real quick. Perfect. Actually, yeah! That actually works pretty well. Alright. Um, okay, yeah, that part back there is not decorating, but that's as expected. Oh, and even here, you know what? Deal with that. You know what? I'll deal with back here, too. Why not? Alright, and 
And that is it for the coffee shop. I was going to redesign the tables, but I had no time. But you know what? While we're here, let's place the china flags. Also, just to be clear, this these rooms are exclusively only here to celebrate the first weekend of the Olympics, which means just this event in general, because this all goes for the first weekend of the Olympics. So, that's pretty cool. Moving on, we have the library. I'll throw the rest out of the outside in just a second. Let me just go in here. Okay, so I never actually finished the walls in here. I never got a chance to actually finish. But, uh, in reality, that's okay. But, hey, at least I did something related. Don't worry, the rest of these buildings are complete. Alright, next up is this house. Yeah, see, the rest of the walls are complete. Now, one of these walls remind me of is Lego Island Christmas 2017. Never thought I would bring that up again. And, uh... Well, I'll come back right now and tour all these rooms. Yeah, I think we have enough flags. All right, no, but really, this is actually what the village looks like. So I designed the village like China to celebrate the start of the Olympics. Because, well, if I did that for the Lagos Island Summer 2021 World Tour from July 23 to the 25th, where I designed the theme park like, you know, Tokyo, Japan, to celebrate the start of the Tokyo 2020 Olympics, um, because it was held there, six months prior, or six to seven months prior, why not just do the same here to celebrate the start of the Winter Olympics of 2022? It all makes sense. It really does. I mean, I couldn't pass the opportunity. It feels great. Do you know Anyway, there's still definitely plenty of snow around here. Don't worry, I kept a good majority of the snow, I promise. See, see, look, I kept a good majority of the snow. So, with that being said, and of course we have the beautiful Great Wall. With all the flags. I think I placed a little too many here, but you know what? In reality, it's worth it. Alright, so that's pretty cool in my opinion. What are your all, uh, what are all your thoughts on this? Yep, this room is all exclusive to not only just the first weekend of the Winter Olympics, but this event in general. So after this, of course, this design will be removed. Alongside, you know, the rest of the party. Um, but yep, I put this here for free to celebrate the start. Anyway, with that being said, uh, I also put flags up here on the zombie cage. I really should use it again at some point, and don't worry, I will. Uh, but now, let's actually tour this again. Let's go back in and tour this officially. So, yep, that's how this looks. It's pretty awesome. Alright, and now let's go tour the library again. So yeah, that's again how it looks. I know I already was just in here, but I feel like touring it again. Now we can go in here and tour this house. So that's how it looks. Looks pretty awesome in my opinion. Alright! Lastly but not least, this house. Yep. It's pretty awesome. And that is it for every single room in this party. Yep. That's it. That is literally it for every single room in this party. Looks awesome. And I truly think I did a good job. With that being said, um, yeah, we have six dogs here. It's pretty awesome. Well, I guess we have like two or three more just because, you know, the dogs. You know, the small ones. Oh, wait a minute, guys! I completely forgot about an item! Oh! 
Yeah, I was about to end the video. Uh, I completely forgot an item. Going down here to the dog park? Yeah. I forgot an item. Oh, I am glad I caught that right before um, ending the video. The Return of New York trips out. We're not going to put that on because, of course, we already have the 600 episode hack. Just the 600 episode hack in general. That is why I'm not going to put it on. No items down here, but in the next episode on February 6th. Um, actually, you know what? For the sake of it being February 5th, I'm just going to go ahead and go down there and collect that item. All right, I have done it. Now, actually, before we do, let's go ahead and feed all the dogs one more time. At least in this video, that is. Yep, we're going to feed all the dogs because they are definitely low on health. Oh, especially Steven. He was low on health. Thank God, we got a lot of dogs in this episode. Anyway, again, February 5th. Let's see what this item is. It is a snowball. Now, this is a reference to the fact that on February 5th, 2017, we actually had a... Well, me and Frozen Rose Crystal had a, you know, a mini snowball fight. And, um, yeah, I just wanted to reference that. The, uh, right here. Yep, yeah, Rose Crystal and I had, like, a mini snowball fight in, like, the back review on February 5th, 2017, so I kind of wanted to reference that. Woo! Yeah! Okay, I'm not going to go all insane like I used to, at least right now. Also, again, granted, because, no. <clears throat> Once again, it's almost 1 a.m. Don't want to be up all night again. So, yep, that's pretty cool. All right, so, yep, I unlocked the item now just because it is technically February 5th now, as you can clearly see on the screen. So, that's pretty cool. All right, everybody. So, that is really cool. Now, with all that being said, thank you guys for watching the 600th episode of Lagos Island. I know most of these episodes are just showcasing the event I set up for them. And don't worry, that's only just because this event is standalone without anything else going on. While as the last few milestone episodes have actually had something going on. This is the first episode since episode 200, at least the first milestone episode ever since episode 200, to be completely standalone and I would only showcase the event in that video. This is the second time I would do that, and that would be the only thing I would do in the video. The next one, which again occurs on Halloween, That'll be the Halloween episode, so there's going to be a lot going on in the 700th episode. With all that being said, I'll see you all in the next episode on February 6th, which is for the three-year anniversary of the corruption of this world. I'll see you guys all in the next one. Goodbye, everybody. And once again, happy 600th episode of Legos Island. Here's the 700 episodes on Halloween.